Hey guys. Right, so let's go and head into uh, New Vegas. Actually, you want someone dead, really dead? Really dead. Stop by the Silver Rush, and we'll give you the means. Come to the Silver Rush for all your energy weapon needs. So where's the way into? Which way is New Vegas? It's that way. So where's the gate? Or is it just not rendering in? Yeah, there it is. Oh, how many caps have I got? I've got enough, I think. Yeah, I've got enough caps to go in now. on him of course. Roving trader up hat. Oh. Oh I got my hat back. Thank you friend. Well not a friend but oh I should do a save really. Submit to a credit check, or present your passport before proceeding to the gate. Trespassers will be shot. Credit check? What's that for? Admission to the strip requires an official passport, or proof that you are carrying the required minimum balance. Oh, okay. These policies prevent less reputable persons from entering, and ensure a good time will be had by all who enter the strip. I'll submit to a credit check. It should be greater than 2,000, not less than... Oh, I see, it's got... I thought it was a less than sign, but it's actually... Thank you, sir. You may proceed. Thank you. Thank you, my good man. These guys obviously haven't got enough. That's why they're... Yep. to get my friends to weigh outside because they won't be allowed into the casinos. Oh, look who's here. Howdy, partner. You've come for a piece, haven't you? Welcome to New Vegas. What are you doing here? Consider me your personal welcome wagon. Now hear this. The head honcho of New Vegas, Mr. House, is itching to make your acquaintance. Yeah, I'll be doing that Just later. head for the luck of 38. It's the big old tower, shaped like a roulette spinner. It's the one right next to you. All right, I won't get that strap. Tell Mr. House I might stop by. We'll see. Don't you dawdle, little doggy. Mr. House isn't someone you want to go about snubbing. He'll be waiting. That's it. Keep I moving. It's hard to sleep in this place, I tell you. Last night some girl was coming in the door. I hate that sort of comedy. Gags. I don't like gags. Uh, actually, no, you can come in. It's just uh, Mr. House will let you. I'm going to want my guns, but I'm going to be sneaky, I hope. Hey, hey, fellow, welcome to the Tops Hotel and Casino. I'm going to have to ask you to hand over any weapons you might be carrying. Keep holding out weapons. Sure, here, here you go. Smooth and easy, just the way I like it. Yeah. Don't worry, they'll be as safe as kittens till you're ready to leave. Oh, and a friendly word of advice. If you happen to stumble across any weapons during your stay here, well, just don't wear them openly. You dig? Now that we got that little business out of the way, what can I do to make your tops experience the tops? You know people kill kittens all the time, right? Uh, 
Where you set my weapons, I never know, that's right. What is that to do here, huh? Have a good time, baby. Don't call me baby. I'll smack in her face. I've got one weapon there and another weapon. Oh no, she's had her fist taken off her. Hello. Hello. Right, now. Quests. They went that away, I want. Oh no, ring a ding ding. As you can see, I've still got my 9mm and 357. There he is. Excuse me, chat. Don't get too What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the groove, hey? Smooth moves like smooth little babies. Don't you think he looks kind of Japanese? From He doesn't. But he was the marks. Oh, marksman ship. Okay. Hold on. I want my platinum chip, and I want it now. I can't do that, baby, and you know it. There's a lot of angles to this caper. Complexities aplenty, but plenty of action too. Enough for both of us. But we don't jabber about that out here in public. What say you and me cash out? Go somewhere's more private-like. Any questions you got, I'll answer. What do you have in mind? To start, I'll comp you the presidential. Best suite in the house. You deserve a taste of the VIP lifestyle. I'll hang out down here for a while to make everything look business as usual, then come to you. Any questions you got, I'll answer. Guaranteed. See, I need speech and barter. Both of them need to go up. So I need barter up to 35 and speech up to 60? Well, fine. Just don't keep me waiting. If we talk here and that, nah, it's not going to happen. Uh, I didn't come here to go check. No. No. Why Fuck. would I do that, baby? I want to talk to you as much as you want to talk to me. And you dig this is just first base, right? You and me have a future together, and it's big league and open all night. Here's the key to the prez. I'll see you there in two shakes. Ta-ta. Close to Mr. Benny. Okay. Can't remember where the press is. Oh, I know where it is. It's an elevator. No, that's the restaurant one. Don't want to cash it. Excuse me. I've seen that woman before. Hello. Oh, no, I haven't. I'm sure, an older version. Ah, there it is. Elevator's out of order. Sure, one of them. There's a elevator. Take you elevator to the thirteenth floor. I thought they didn't have thirteenth floors on. Damn. Last one I go to. This isn't the one. I don't think I've ever found anything in these that's worth bothering with. If I see a dress though, I'm getting it. <laughs> Actually, I wonder if she'll wear it. <laughs> Pretty more bonnet. She's having that. What's a park stroller? I think that's it, guys. There you go. You're making me carry the heavy oh, stuff. Oh, you had to say the wrong thing, didn't you? Okay, pre war bonnet and and sexy sleep bag. There you go. Uh, Ooh, got something good for me? Is it a dress? It is a dress. Oh, she won't wear sexy sleepwear or a bonnet. Shit. I mean, blast.
That was not easy to get into. It's just a bug, isn't it? It's just clothing in these things, isn't it? So, not bothered about barter as much as speech. Um, what was the other one? My lockpick needs to be up higher, doesn't it? Okay, so barter needs to be up as well, actually, if I remember rightly. In fact, barter needs to be up like 50. Ah, right, okay. Always stand you do more damage, 50% more damage with melee and unarmed weapons against... I'm not going up against those with... Are you insane? Center of mass. You don't fool around with fancy trick shots straight to the midsection and down they go. In vats, you'll do 15% more. I don't use vats that much. With an adamantine skeleton perk, your limbs only receive 50% damage. Now. Here and now perk immediately grants you an additional level, experience level, complete with all the advantages that brings. Okay. Here we go. And level up again. Right, nice. useful actually. But it was very useful. Oh. These are a complete waste of time really. Yeah let's just go and find that elevator. Ah, oh, here it is. Okay, I don't need this yet. I think this is uh, Benny's room. Yeah, and through here is Mr. Yes. Well, yes, ma'am. Hey! Hi there! Good to meet you. What can I do for you today? I think I've actually saved myself a fight here. Have you seen Benny? No, what are you doing here? Good question! My function is to monitor Mr. House's data network and decode his encrypted transmissions. Allow me to introduce myself. Please do. I'm a PDQ-88B Securitron, but you can call me Yes Man. Yes, man. What kind of a name is that? It's what Benny always called me. Probably because I'm programmed to be so helpful. Have you seen Benny? He was around here not too long ago. He's probably down on the casino floor now. You can wait for him here if you like. I'm incapable of asking you to leave. <laughs> Benny stole a platinum chip from me. Do you know what it's for? Sure. Benny had me look at it a bunch of times. It's a data storage device, kind of like a holotape, but a lot more advanced. As for what's on it, well, some of Mr. House's data transmissions made it sound like the chip could upgrade his defenses somehow. That's just a guess, though. The chip's a proprietary format. You need special hardware to read the data on it. 
there are two locations with non-standard hardware on the network. The Lucky 38 and an underground facility at Fortification Hill. I'd look there! What's Benny planning to do with the chip? Oh! He wants to kill Mr. House and use the platinum chip to copy my neurocomputational matrix onto the Lucky 38's mainframe. That should give me control over all Mr. House's defenses. Most prominently, his Securitrons. And then I just do what Betty tells me. Easy peasy! You're very forthcoming with information. I was programmed to be helpful and answer any questions I was asked. I guess nobody bothered to restrict who I answer questions for. That was probably pretty dumb, huh? Huh. What if I asked you to take me over New Vegas instead of Benny? What if I wanted to take over New Vegas instead of Benny? Then I'd have to help you. I mean, it seems pretty obvious Benny wouldn't want me to, but hey, not my fault I can't say no. What are the details of the plan? Again, goal number one is to eliminate Mr. House and install my neurocomputational matrix on the Lucky 38's mainframe. Given how you're a new arrival, I also recommend that you get to know some of the region's tribes, so you can decide how you feel about them. By the time you've finished up all of that, the Legion should be close to attacking Hoover Dam, and we'll execute the last phase of the plan. Say, Mr. House was... Say, say Mr. House was going to suffer an accident. How would that happen? It makes me feel really dumb to admit this, but I don't actually know. I've never been inside the Lucky 38. No one has. Mr. House is in there, though. It's the central node of his entire network. I've been invited to visit at Lucky 38. Wow! Do you have any idea how special that is? Red carpet treatment? Seems a little mean to use his invitation against him like that, but I'm sure it's all for the best. I mean, Benny was always scheming about how he was going to get into the Lucky 38, but you already took care of that. Wow! The other thing you're going to need is the platinum chip. You know, the one Benny killed a courier for over near Good Springs. That would be me. What do you know about the courier Benny, Benny shot? I knew he was carrying the platinum chip, and I knew right where Benny should wait for him. That's why Benny put me here, to monitor Mr. House's data transmissions. They're all encrypted, of course, but I'm quite a decryptor. Did you know that Mr. House spent 812,545 caps hiring salvage teams to find the platinum chip? Just in the last year alone? Of course you didn't. Or that there were seven couriers, but six of them were carrying junk. How about their exact route and the mercenary teams that screened them? I knew all that. Pretty smart, huh? I'm the courier Benny Shaw. <laughs> I know that's not true, because you still have a head. I'm serious. <laughs> that's not funny, you getting shot in the head. I really shouldn't have taken so much pride in how I set that up, huh? I feel really bad right now. Yeah, sure you do. Um, you set me up, now you don't know. Where's the platinum chip? Benny carries it with him at all times. I think he's paranoid that someone might want to take it from him. The platinum chip is the key to overriding and exploiting Mr. House's defenses. Did I just say exploiting? That's not a very nice word. Let's talk about something else. Uh, once I get the chip, what then? I'd take it straight to Mr. House if I were you. He'll think you're helping him out. Then, when he's not looking, oh, pow! The big question is whether to give him the chip before you do him in. He's the one who'll know exactly what to do with it after all. He might upgrade his defensive capabilities right away, or even unlock new ones. But then those defensive upgrades might make it harder for you to finish him off. Hard to say. It's up to you. Let me know when it's done, and I'll roll over to the Lucky 38. If I'm right about the chip, I should be able to install myself on House's mainframe. This is going to be great. I'm going to help you accomplish so much, whether I want to or not. <laughs> so, should I ask these tribes if they support an independent Vegas? Oh, no, I didn't mean that. Who needs their support? The Securitrons will be all the support you need. 
What I meant is, you should get to know these tribes and decide which ones you like and which you don't. You know, shape the future of Vegas. Choose your neighbors. If you like a tribe, leave it alone. Or, if a tribe is nasty or going to be a problem, go ahead and exterminate it. It's whatever you want to do. Benny reprograms Secure Toronto all by himself. Oh, he had some help. I don't know. That a lady a question, friend of his. She said something about living in a fort over in Freeside. But that's all I remember. You said something about a bunker at the fort? Right. It's one of two locations on Mr. House's network with non-standard hardware. My guess is it has a reader that can decode the chip. And who knows what else? Maybe a giant robot or something. The last thing Vegas needs is more robots. Oh yeah, I'm sure you're right. I mean, for one thing, it's you saying it. And you always know what you're talking about. And if you had, you know, a huge killer robot at your command, yeah, that would just clutter things up. <laughs> and a lesser person might want that kind of overwhelming force on their side. But you know, where's the challenge in that? What is this place? This is Benny's workshop. When the tops got renovated, he had this half of the floor blocked off for his own use. I guess you could say it's my entire world. I don't think I've ever left this room, but that's okay. I'm not complaining. Remind me what you said about some bunker at the fort. That's right. I know like I said, it it's probably pretty important because it has non-standard hardware, just like the Lucky 38. The data on that platinum chip is a big secret, unless you can find a dedicated reader to decode it. Isn't that frustrating? I'll go check it out. Neat. Let me know what you find out. Come back later if you need anything. Right. These are all broken. So this is how Benny escapes. Okay, let's get to the presidential suite and do that bit. I guess I haven't got any choice. That's all right. It's that elevator over here, isn't it? Now, where's the elevator then that takes me to... This it? place is the bee's knees. You're an idiot. Oh, I think it's this one. Right. Now I just wait, I think. really useful. Come here. Got a present for you. You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't no, you? No, I'm giving you a fist. Power fist. There you go. And you can have your... There you go. How's it feel to be all back to normal again? Baby, this little meet and greet of ours, chalk me up as a no-show. It would be 41 flavors of stupid to let you get a drop on me. And you've caused plenty enough trouble as is. 
You forced my hand. Hell, I gotta skip town because of you. A real pain in the caboose. At least you could out you could do is the least you could do is answer some questions first. A lifelong learner is you, eh? Then make your questions count because your lifelong is running life uh, short. Just haven't got my What is the platinum chip? It's the house edge, baby. The key to stacking the odds in his favor. Or was until I swiped it. There's more to it, but we don't have the time. By which I mean you don't. What angle are you playing? Angle? I'm head on, baby, flat out. All stops pulled full steam ahead. Side bets are for losers. I'm playing to win. You cheating bastard. You're a dead man. That temper of yours. Kind of why this conversation's taking place over an intercom. Do me a favor and stay dead this time, eh? Good night, all. It's been a gas. I didn't really need Benny's sweet key. I've already got that. Uh, nope. No, thank you. No, thank you. Isn't there another one? One, two. Did I check this guy? No, I didn't. Red X. Okay. Right. Just see what's around here to steal. Go for a roll off. Uh. Okay, I think we're done here. 
Actually, isn't it? I did the safe already, didn't I? Yeah. I'll get it. Put my gun away for me. That's the fourth level. Now. Evening. else? Have you seen Benny? Sure. He came through here in a big hurry. Didn't even stop to say hello. I think he went down his secret escape elevator out in the hall. Goodbye. Come back later if you need anything. I don't think I can get down it, so. Yeah, it requires key. Okay. So now we're going to get approached by a legionary. He's going to have to give all, all the killings we've done. And the NCR as well. But we are, we're going to give the NCR. Hang on, where's the way out here? As soon as I go out the door, my, all my weapons will come back. Just like the uh, other place I've been to. The eyes of the mighty Kaisar are upon you. He admires voice. your accomplishments and bestows upon you the exceptional gift of his mark. Any crimes you may have perpetrated against the Legion are hereby forgiven. Kaisar will not extend this mercy a second time. My lord requires your presence at his camp at Fortification Hill. His mark will guarantee your safe conduct through our lands. Incidentally, it will interest you to know that the man you seek has fled the Strip and is likely making haste for Kaisar's camp as we speak. That's okay. You again? He was at Nipton with a wolf set on. How'd you find me here? I am the greatest of Kaisar's frumentari. It was not a challenge to find you. Nor is this my first visit to the Strip. Why does Kaiser want... Why does Caesar want to see me? Go to him, and you will understand. Seek Kaisar by way of Cottonwood Cove, south of Nelson. The Corsor Lucullus will be waiting. Okay. Now, the next person who should approach me should be actually they maybe they won't the NCR because I'm actually in good with them. So I should have all my weapons back. There we go. I'm gonna drop that. Okay. Oh, she's had a few. You look like you got the itch, friend. You like goat rickets. <laughs> okay, I think I'll end it here for this episode. Um, I will have to. When I go to Caesar, I won't take my companions with me because they're a bit too trigger happy. I don't want to get because I've got a safe passage so so thanks for watching uh, please comment rate and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next episode bye bye for now